Hello people and welcome. Today we're going to be talking about FAIR for all its rights. The vegan shoe company. Okay, so earlier this year when we were in uh, Budapest, we watched a horrible film called Earthlings and it taught us all about how horrible we as humanity, humans, we as humanity? We as humans are to animals and it was partly about how horrible we are to pets, how horrible we are because we use um, animals in experiments, how horrible we are because we eat them and um, one of the big bits of it though was how horrible we are because we use animals for food. That's a note for clothes. And food. And food as well, of course. Um, so one of our first steps after watching it was to become vegetarians immediately. We're trying um, slowly to become vegan, so what we're doing at the moment is, like I said, we're vegetarian. We're starting to try and do two meals a week vegan and then it's going to be two days and gradually we hope by next year we'll be vegan. It is a bit harder for us because obviously we're travelling all the time and we aren't very good at cooking but we're also it's often impossible for us to read the ingredients so um you know if you don't eat meat and you're abroad it's kind of obvious because it's like oh yeah that's got ham in it oh that's that's got cow in it but with stuff like eggs and butter and milk it's pretty much in it's in so many things you don't even realize it's hard anyway we're trying getting there slowly um we knew immediately that we could cut out the using animals for sports like we would never go hunting anyway we would never go to a, like a bull all that bull stuff they do in spain chasing the bulls and bull with the flappy what's that called yeah that's not for us anyway yeah, that's not for us that was easy to to cut out so yeah we're trying with the food we've immediately cut out animals for sport anyway the final point was about the clothing and that we thought that is something we can easily change you know we can be responsible when we buy clothes and uh, similar things so yeah one of the big things obviously is leather and I do recommend you watch Earthlings just because you won't want to have leather afterwards and it's just really sad what they do to the cows I don't want to say because I'll probably get it wrong but anyway so most people have leather in their shoes and we want with this year we've been kind of looking for more and more companies that don't use leather in their shoes and we managed to find fair for all its rights. They're Peter approved so you know that they're great. Basically their ethos is to combine nice style with ethicalness which you know is great because as much as we yeah. want to help animals we also kind of want to look good at the same time. So. And that's achievable with you know these brands that are approved by the Peter website you can find out more about that in the description there's links and all sorts um but yeah these fair shoes are really really cool they not only look cool they're also ethical and so much more and we're going to show you them right now so we're starting off with the shoe uh that i got provided the pair of shoes not just one shoe <laughs> here it is Ooh. And Laura is going to read us the features for this shoe right now. So this is, you can find the shoe on the FAIR website and it's called the Everyday Chelsea Boot. The Everyday Chelsea Boots and as you can see they're black. So the outer is upper quality Italian uh, microfiber, breathable and eco-friendly. It doesn't contain half harmful products like PVC, so it's PVC free. And you know it's Italian so you know, you know it's stylish. Uh, the lining is 100% breathable and anti-allergy microfiber. Um, it's ecological microfiber made at CO2 free manufacturing system and does not contain harmful products e.g. Oecotech, it's Oecotech certified, I think that's how you say it, O-E-K-O tech certified. The outer sole is Neolite and is ethically manufactured in Portugal. Let's say made in Portugal. As you can see here, made in Portugal. Made in Portugal. And you'll know Tambay's shoe size now, so feel free to send me <laughs> shoes. As long as they're vegan. Yeah, that's right. Um, and in the inside, it doesn't actually have their logo or their brand on. Oh no, they do have a little, tiny little, probably, I don't know if you can see that. That's embarrassed me now. Um, very mm. subtle, so it's not in your face. And it also has fair, it says fair, you probably can't see that. It says fair here on the inside. That's right. Yeah. It's very light. And it's, yeah, it is very light. I was going to say that they're really comfortable to wear. Um, we're going to wear them on our upcoming Iceland trip, Germany trip, and um, Italy. It, what, Italy. Of course. And yeah, wherever else we might go. So the link to these shoes is below in the description. Go and check them out. Uh, the company has, at the time of making this video, they have a sale on as well. So check out some off. bargains. That's right, 30% off. All right, next up. My shoes. <laughs> so I went for the lime flower sandals no wait lime flower slippers 
And you can read it out if you like. I want to hold it. Definitely. So the first things first, these make my feet look really nice and slim. So, you know, tick the stylish box. I love the colours. I love this blue. It's two different blues, actually. which And the nice kind of beigey, creamy. I think that's great. Again, you've got the fair written on the inside and made in Portugal on the bottom. And I think there was a... I mean, mine doesn't have a logo on the outside like Tambo's do. But yeah. Lovely, no. nice little heel, a little bit of extra. So what That's can right, we so the outer really layer is textile and upper quality Italian microfiber and again it doesn't contain harmful products and it's uh, PVC free. Yay! The lining is 100% breathable and anti-allergy microfiber, isn't that cool? That's really good. And yeah, it's um, it's microfiber made at CO2 free manufacturing system and does not contain harmful products. Mm. That's really good. It's really good. Yeah, so you can see they look good, you can hear they, they've been made lovelyly, lovelyly, <laughs> and they're really comfy, so what more could you want in a shoe? Obviously they're not made of leather, so they're not bad for animals. They're made in Portugal, they're also, um, they have really good rights for the workers, so it's not just animals they're nice to, they're also nice to the people, which That's is, right. it's really important. That is important, you know? no child labour, no slave yeah. labour, no blood, sweat or tears. Um, they feel it's important. like love, you know, they feel good. Yeah, again, I'm going to be wearing these in Iceland, and we'll see how lovely they look in Iceland. Lovely, I think. Alright, people, and that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Again, all the links for these shoes and for the company fair.pt are in the description below this video. And um, subscribe to this channel if you're new. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment below. Tell us, um, are you buying ethical clothing brands or any brands? If not, why not? And if you do, tell us which brands do you like. And that's it for us from today. We shall yeah. see you tomorrow for more fun in England. Thanks to Fair, obviously, for introducing us to their shoes and for um, providing us with these amazing shoes. We're really, really thankful. And yeah, that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching. Ciao. Ciao.